Hey y'all, it's Shannon. So I'm coming at you with a Mimi Box unboxing, which I'm so excited. So as I've stated in some previous videos, I ordered three color boxes at one time. It was buy two, get one free. A lot of times Mimi Box will have like deals on like like if you buy two boxes it's like ten dollars cheaper but these were only 15 bu bucks a piece which is kind of like the mini boxes i guess i don't know these are smaller than the regular ones i usually get so i will say that but that doesn't make me love them any less just because they're a little smaller so anyhow <laughs> and fyi i do have some coupon codes and stuff in the information box below feel free to use those if you want so, yes. Okay, so this is the Mimi Box color box number one. It's the red box. So, so excited. So excited. So, this is it. What it looks like. And I love... Okay, so Mimi Box just kind of adds little extra touches sometimes that I really kind of appreciate, like a dork. So, like, the blue box had blue tissue paper, and the red box has red tissue paper. So, that's kind of cool, because I'm kind of a dork like that. So, the first product is your Berry Flirt Lipstick in 08 Red Parade. It's $12. It is a full-size product. Let's see if I can open it now. The Flirt Packaging, very bright pink from Dear Berry. And it's very pretty, actually. Look at that. That's a really pretty red. Okay, so I took off my lipstick because I meant to do that before I actually started filming this, but that didn't happen. So I'm going to try this lipstick on. I'm really excited. I'm going to give you guys a little swatchy swatchy. It's quite beautiful red of it first. And then you're going to, I have to say so far, like the Korean lip products I've tried are extremely emollient. Like it gives color, like color. Look at this. <laughs> do you see? Yeah, color. But, like, and I know I got, I got, I got a little smeared here, but it, like, it's so emollient. I don't know, like, there are a lot of lipsticks I've tried that, like, especially are not nearly as emollient, and, like, I mean, that's not entirely true. I've tried some other brands. There are a lot of brands that are very emollient, but these just seem to be, like, really, like, almost verging like really really like they're really emollient like my lips always feel very refreshed and hydrated when I wear them I really like the hope girl one I got a lot too uh, a couple months like a couple months ago I think so I don't know so what do y'all think just ignore that crazy little hair that decided to curl and weird out I think it's not a bad color. I like it. But I like most lipstick colors, and I'm a big believer. If I like it, I'm going to wear it, be confident in it, and it'll look fabulous, right? That's what I believe we should believe, <laughs> irregardless of what society tells me, because I'm going to wear it anyways. So the next product I got is number two, Dear Berry, and you could get it in either number 21, Pink Sprinkling. Oh, no, you only got one. It's number 21, Pink Sprinkling. And it's kind of, it's very much like a red color. I don't know what else to say. It's red with a little bit of a pink undertone. It's $3 and it is indeed a full-sized product. Hey. Okay, and this box, this is the only difference between the red box, the orange box, and the blue box. The red box has five products. So the third product is the Lotion, Leotion, Leotion. Please someone tell me how to pronounce it. I really hate mispronouncing stuff. It will only take me a year and a half to get through all this bubble wrap. The Leotion, Leo, Leotion, Leotion, that's what I'm going to go with, Leotion, in the color red, L35, 4 grams. It's full-sized. It's a $10 product. And it is a beautiful red. I actually have, um, Ulta makes a red eyeshadow in... It's called Cherry Bomb, but it's much brighter. This is a much darker red, and does it say this is matte? Yeah. I This is a matte color. It's beautiful. I'm, ex I'm so excited to try this. I think red and orange colors, I don't know what it is, but when you have brown eyes, it just, it brings out, like, 
is kind of natural, but like dramatic. And it's just, it leaves the world open for so much. I really love red and orange colors on brown eyes. I don't know why. Not to say that anyone else with any other color eyes wouldn't look fabulous with it as well. I just know personally, I love wearing red and orange eyeshadow on my eyes because I just, I think it looks beautiful. And there's just something about it that just makes you go, wow. So, okay, enough of my gawking. <laughs> On to the fourth product. It is the Tussle Womb Macon Gel Pencil Liner in 04 Burgundy, full size, $10. So excited. I do not have a burgundy liner. It is like the one color of the rainbow I do not possess because here in America, I don't know, there are certain colors that here in the U.S., it's not that we can't find them, it's that you can't find them reasonably priced. That's the best way to put that. So the packaging is really pretty. The outside is kind of a burgundy-ish color. It's very dark purpley. So very, very dark. I Like for instance, I know you can get burgundy, but it's Stila is the only one I know of that makes it and maybe like Urban Decay. So very pretty, very like dark burgundy kind of color. Looking forward to trying that oh so much. Make sure with the gel pencil liners you're putting the cap back on pretty good too because those will dry out just FYI. So my fifth and final product is from Cheek Room. I I want to say I've gotten a Cheek Room product before but I don't honestly remember. So who knows but this is a lip gloss. Very okay this is weird. Check it out it's like two colors. So it says this highly enriched with grapeseed oil, Cheek Room's popular two-color lip gloss will not only moisturize chapped lips, but also deliver a long-lasting, glossy finish to your lips. In addition, the special lip gloss is actually consisted of two different colors within a single-layer product. Very cool! So you can create different color variations according to your mood and style. How the heck does that work? Okay. Now i got to take off my lipstick and... I'm going to take my lipstick off and we're going to try this out because that just sounds so cool. We got Okay, so we're uh, opening. I don't know how this works. It sort of freaks me out. It smells kind of like cherry candy a little bit. So can you see the tip that some of the color got on? The lower color got up here and then the additional like clear color kind of sucked the rest of the tube. It is a doe foot applicator. Let's see how this works. Pretty wicked. I think the only thing with this is it's definitely not going to stay separated. Like, can you see it's already getting all swirled around and I've only used it once. Which is fine. It doesn't, that's whatever. But I will say it is really cool looking. A very unique product. Um, so it's a lip gloss. It's not sticky at all. Like, I wouldn't consider it a sticky lip gloss. And but I'm really down with the sticky lip gloss because they stay on a long time. So, But this one is supposed to have good staying power according to Mimi Box. So this may be something I review later just because. So. so that is it. That's all I got. I know. I'm sad it ended too. So anyhow, the value of the box will be below. I will also put in some coupon codes if you wish to use them on Mimi Box. Go for it. That's my motto. So anyhow... I will talk to y'all later. Oh, please do me a huge favor if you would like this video and subscribe to this channel for more unboxings and hauls and reviews. I like doing those things. So anyways, y'all have a good day. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.